today I thought I would introduce a new series to my channel and kickstart the series with a video of my bathroom and everything that's in it. The new series that I want to bring to my channel is called Tour Tuesday. So basically some Tuesdays I will be posting videos of tours. So they may be a closet tour, a makeup collection tour, a bedroom tour, a... I don't even know. So today I thought I would kickstart the Tour Tuesdays with a tour of my bathroom. I've recently revamped my bathroom and organized it thoroughly, so I'm really, really happy with what it looks like and I thought I would share it with you guys today. So I hope you guys like my new idea and I hope you guys enjoy the video. So if you guys want to see what's in my bathroom, then just keep watching. So this is the main area of my bathroom. As you guys can see, there's a huge mirror over there. And then there's two basins. This one is mine on the far side. And this is my brother's. So I'm not going to get into like what products he uses. So in between the two basins, we keep a few things. First of all, we have a Colgate toothpaste and a few more toothpastes in there. There's also a box of tissues and a fragrance sort of thing that's kind of running out. But that just kind of keeps the bathroom smelling really nice and really fresh and clean. Then you have my basin, which I just keep my dental foam soap over there. And I keep this glass container where I just have like um, cotton balls in there just so when I'm removing my eye makeup or need it to remove nail polish and stuff like that. So I like to keep them in this little glass jar and I think it's really cute and handy. Now on the right side of my basin is where I keep a majority of my products that I use on a regular basis. If you guys can see I have two separate containers. I just push them together so that I save space. On the left hand side I keep all my things to do with teeth whitening and stuff like that. And the right hand side I keep products that have stuff to do with my skin and makeup removal and stuff like that. So I've just got some easy flosses there. I have my Crest White Toothpaste, uh, Plus White Whitening, um, 5 Minute Whitening Bleach Gel thing. I have Crest White Strips. I have a Crest Mouthwash and then I also have a Listerine Mouthwash at the back. So on this side is where I keep my face products. Some of them I use on a daily basis and others I don't really use as regularly. So I've got my Witch Hazel Toner, a Garnier Moisturizer, a Garnier Expo Brush Cleanser, a Derm Organics Toner, a Derm Organics Moisturizer. Then I also have like this tiny sample which is just like a body wash that I got at a hotel. And then I also have my Cetaphil Moisturizer, my Palmer's Cocoa Butter Moisturizer. And then I have this little container here which I just keep like a few little earbuds in there just so um, whenever I need one I can just reach right for it here. Going down you can see there's lots and lots of different drawers. I'm going to go through them one by one to show you guys what I keep in them. These two over here are actually my brothers so I'm not going to go into them. So this shelf has two different levels. The first level is where I keep my spare earbuds so that when I want to refill my little container I can do so. I also keep some pads at the back for my girly needs, some spare cotton balls. Then at the back there I have spare um, iPads, so yet again if I want to remove my makeup I've got a few little cotton pads there. And then in front of that I just keep a couple of candles that I'm not actually using at the moment. I will kind of change my candles up a little bit, so sometimes I'll display some candles and put some away. So this is just where I keep the candles I am not using. Then down the bottom here you can see there's a few more candles here. I've got my Viva La Fluoro candle and my Yin Yang candle on the bottom. I also have a few candles and candle oils there. And then here I keep just my skull shot glasses that I got for my birthday. Moving on from that drawer now onto these two drawers here which are directly in the middle of my bathroom. So the first one stores a variety of different things. In this container over here I have all my soaps. So I've got lots of different goat's milk bars and other little scented bars over there. I then keep some Kleenex tissues and a mud mask. So when I'm having my girly pamper nights I can just go into this drawer and put a mask on my face. Then I keep a QV exfoliator, a Dove Summer Glow moisturizer, a pump cleanser by Clean and Clear and then I have this container over here so in here I keep a spare toothbrush which I don't think I've ever used um, some spare toothbrush heads I also keep a couple of pairs of scissors and combs 
and just like random stuff like that that I just keep in this little container. Then at the front, I keep a Clearasil Rapid Action um, container, which has all the Clearasil Rapid Action pads in it. I also keep a, another little container. And in this container, I just keep a comb and a couple of hair ties because I always am running out and losing hair ties, so I keep them all in this little container here. So that is that drawer done and dusted. Let's move on to the drawer below. So in the bottom drawer, I keep a few more products. I keep a couple of rolls of roller towel or paper towels. I have a giant like one liter bottle of nail polish remover. I just have some bleach for when I'm like cleaning the bathroom. At the front, I have a Veet hair removal cream, a Colgate mouthwash, and then in this container over here, I just keep a few spare um, toothpastes and stuff like that, so that's where I keep those. Moving on to this drawer, which is directly under my basin. This is like a really, really random collection of things that I've kind of thrown into two shelves. So at the top, I have some toilet paper, spare toilet paper rolls, etc, etc. I have this little container which I keep a few paintbrushes in. Then I have some spare Dettol foam soap so that when that needs refilling, I can just refill it straight away. So behind that, I have this little cane box. This box, I keep any sort of samples that I get. So I've got tons and tons of face product samples, pretty full with all sorts of products that I'm waiting to try out. I also keep a headband at the back here just so that when I'm washing my face, I can tie my hair up and get all my hair out of my face. Then at the back there is just more cleaning products, really not that exciting. And then at the front here is where I keep my Dermanew Microdermabrasion, I always struggle to say that, uh, my kit. So I've got the exfoliator here, and then I also have my brush heads, and then I've just got the box with like a spare brush head and instructions and all that sort of stuff in there. Now on to the bottom level, I have more spare toilet paper there. Behind that I have a few spare mouth washes by Crest. So I have my Body Shop Peppermint Foot Fizzer here. I also have this container which I keep directly next to that and this has my foot scrubber in it and also an exfoliating scrub that I got from the Body Shop. Then behind that I have a body scrub and I also have a tan extender. Then I also have a travel roll which I just got on the plane and it just keeps a few eye masks and stuff like that in there and I keep that right at the back over there. Then next to that I just have a spare crest whitening toothpaste which I just keep at the corner for when my other one runs out. And then at the front I have this pink container and I'll take that out so I can show you guys what's in it. So I just have a miniature Cetaphil cleanser which is my favourite cleanser in the whole wide world and I've got another one of those as well. I have a shampoo and a conditioner sample which I probably should put in my sample drawer over there. I have a razor which is just like a spare razor that I keep down there. A body wash, Cetaphil moisturiser, a Colgate toothpaste, a shower gel and then I have a mouth guard over there for when I'm teeth whitening and just a little bar of soap as well. Now let's move on to my two drawers on the very right hand side. So the first drawer has a few different things in it. At the back I have my spot treatments in this little glass jar over here. So I've just got a whole bunch of different brands that I like to try out and use when I am fighting breakouts and stuff like that. And then in front of that you guys can see I have like a cane container and this is just where I keep all my moisturizers for my face. So sometimes I'll feel like changing it up and trying a new moisturizer so I just keep all of my various brands in this container here. And the bottom drawer has a bunch of random stuff in it, mostly girly needs if you guys know what I mean. So at the back I just have tampons and liners. In this little container here I have pads, spare tampons, more liners and um, band-aids. I also have a few spare razor heads and then at the front I keep these Vicks Vapor Drops Honey Fresh Soothing Throat Lozenger things. I don't know why they don't really fit in here but whatevs. So that's it for this area of my bathroom and now we're going to move on to my shower and bath and all that sort of fun stuff. So I'm going to start off with my bath and then we will work our way to the shower. 
oh my gosh, that sounded so sexual, it's not even funny. So as you guys can see, I don't really keep too many products next to the bath. I keep most of my products out by the basin or in the shower, but I do keep a couple of products by my bath anyway. So I've got my Cetaphil Gentle Skin Cleanser and my Cetaphil Oily Skin Cleanser. I also have my Garnier Pure 3-in-1 Scrub, which I use for my body. I have a Garnier Pure Active Expo Brush. I have a Deep Clean Organic Hair Body Wash. And I also have my Palm Olive Rich Moisture um, Shower Milk. Then if you move this way, there's a few things that I keep on this side of the bath. So if you guys watched my spa pamper night sort of video, you guys would have definitely seen this sort of area of my bathroom. And basically I just keep a few little candles there because I love to have candle baths. I have a mosaic mirror over here. Then I have a little stand where I keep some of my soaps. And then I have this exfoliating kind of body scrubber. And I also have two little mitts which I also use to scrub my face sometimes and my body. And if you move right, you can see this chest of drawers which I'm going to show you guys what I keep in there. So I keep a few little essentials up the top. At the back here I have like a body wash kit which I got, hello you guys can see me, for Christmas from a family friend. I also have this white container where I keep a few little things body wash related. And so I have my I Love Strawberries and Milkshakes body wash. I have one of these massage tools and then I also have a body scrubber. Then in front of that I have a few different body washes and body moisturizers. So I've got a Playboy one, I've got these Nicole Richie, these two are Nicole Richie, that's Kylie Minogue and these two are Sex and the City. So I just have a few little body washes and stuff like that there. And then in front of that I have my all time favorite body butter from the body shop. And it literally smells amazing. You guys have heard me talk about this many times in my videos. And I love it. So I keep it right at the top here where I can grab it really quickly. I have another body butter in this little container here. And then I also keep a few makeup sponges up here. I know they don't really fit in, but I mean, I need them. So I kind of keep them up here so I can grab them easily. As you guys can see, there are four different drawers. And each drawer stores a different kind of product, I guess you could say. So the first drawer is where I keep like my leave-in conditioners, dry shampoos, styling mousse, heat protectants and hairspray. So I've got two dry shampoos here. I have two leave-in conditioners, a Garnier volumizing mousse, a John Frieda volumizing spray, a hair protectant and a Schwarzkopf hairspray. Below that I keep the products that I will use once my hair is dry to make it shine or give it more texture or volume or just make it in better condition. So back here I have two of these. These are just the Schwarzkopf Repair Rescue um, Styling stuff, my Bobby stuff. I don't even know what I just said. Then I have a Bedhead Control Freak. I have this texturizing cream, a Kerastase leave-in styling thingy my Bobby. And then at the front I have my Moroccan oil which I swear by this stuff. And I also have my 10 Carat Shine by Schwarzkopf. Below that is a bit of a random drawer. So I have all my hairbrushes and tangle teasers and stuff like that there. I also keep chalk. Now you're probably like, why the hell do you have chalk in your drawer? But I have tried to use this for hair coloring. And if you look it up on YouTube, you can find a ton of stuff about how to color your hair with chalk. So I just keep it there for when I'm feeling experimental. And then I keep this little brush thingy my bobby. And then at the back here I keep a bunch of my smaller products and samples. So I have like some John Frieda and then some more John Frieda, like the Frizzies collection. I have a random sample from Garnier, which is just a shampoo. And then I also keep my Sun Silk shampoo and conditioner, which is good for traveling. So I just keep it in there for when I'm going overseas. And then the bottom drawer just has my heat tools. So I've got my curling iron. In here I have another curling iron. I have my heated rollers and then in my room is actually my straightener but I will usually keep that in here as well. Now last but not least I will take you guys into my shower and uh, show you guys what I keep in there. So let's go have a little look. So here is where I keep two more body scrubbers. Then I have this little I guess you could say pedestal little thing. And I keep my Kerastase conditioning mask there. 
I also keep another Cetaphil cleanser and my Bare Minerals Deep Cleansing Foam. I keep a few products up the top on this other pedestal. So I have a bunch of Head & Shoulders products. I have my Pantene Shampoo, my Johnson's Baby Shampoo, which I use to remove my eye makeup, my L'Oreal Toner, another Cetaphil Skin Cleanser. As you guys can see, I'm completely obsessed. And then behind that is just an exfoliator. And then I have another exfoliator and this is just a body wash as well. And I also keep my razor up here as well. And that's pretty much what's in my shower. Another thing I keep in my bathroom is obviously a washing basket. And then I have a scale as well, which I keep on the floor next to the bathtub. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. And if you did, then please give it a thumbs up because that would be totally awesome. And if you're a new viewer and not a subscriber, then feel free to hit that subscribe button down below. Uh, thank you for coming to watch my videos. You're awesome. I'm sorry for the length of this video. I did try edit it down as much as I could, but there was just so much to get through. So I do apologize for it being really long, but I hope you guys enjoyed it anyway. And that's pretty much it. So I will see you guys in my next video. I hope you guys have an amazing day. Thank you to my new subscribers and I will see you guys very, very soon. Bye!